to the Easy St. Patrick's Day Manicures. I'm Gianna and in today's video I'm going to be sharing with you three easy St. Patrick's Day nail designs that do not require any tools other than a toothpick or a pen if you don't have a toothpick. This is part of the ultimate nail guides to St. Patrick's Day. There are two other videos that you guys can see. I'll leave the playlist in the description down below. Make sure to check it out if you want to see some more nail art designs that are festive or you didn't like any of these nail designs and you want to see something different. I've been loving your guys' recreations and I wanted to share a few of my favorites. So here they are. And I absolutely love them, so please keep sending them and sharing them with each other and commenting. It makes me so happy to see you guys interacting. I like being able to think that we're doing this all together as a team. On a side note, I woke up in a frenzy this morning. I woke up panicked because I thought I had missed the fashion show that I was supposed to be doing the model's nails for, for Mardi Gras. And I had the nail design, I had everything I had to do, but I completely missed the show and I was getting fired. So this morning I was heart pounding, heart racing, like oh my god, but then I realized it was just a dream. Uh, nobody wants me for a fashion show, <laughs> what are you thinking? And I ended up thinking up a nail design in my dream for Mardi Gras. So I think next week, if you guys want to see it, I'm going to come up with two other uh, Mardi Gras nails. Hopefully you guys want to see it. It should be fun. I'm thinking about the colors to be like gold, green, and lady, gold, green, and purple, and maybe lots of glitter. What do you guys think? Do you want to see something like that? Let me know in the comments down below, okay? Let's get into the first festive manicure. And don't forget to let me know which one's your favorite. One, two, or three. I'll see you guys in a few minutes. Manicure number one. You're going to start off this manicure by applying a gold base to your nails. I'm using this beautiful gold color by Orly, and it's called Luxie. Now taking a green polish, you're going to create a V that kind of peeps out at the top of your nail by simply dragging the brush in a C shape that starts to go down the center of your nail. I've been obsessed with matte nails lately. Has anyone else been? Because I seem to put it on every single design. And I'm using Essie's Matte About You top coat to finish up the design. Moving on to manicure number two. To start this simple design, I'm going to place two different contrasting colors on my nail. I chose a lime green color called Innocent by Sinful Colors and a dark green color called Envy by Sinful Colors. Before the nail polish dries, I'm going to mix the two colors in the center of my nail and fill any holes in by simply tapping or pushing the nail polish with the toothpick. On a side note, if you can't mix the colors or they're kind of clumping together, you probably didn't add enough polish, so just go in and add a second layer of polish to your design. To finish off the design, I'm going to add some sparkle and shine. I'm using this gorgeous glitter mixture by Sinful Colors called Call You Later. Moving on to manicure number three. So to start off this manicure, I used two coats of Four Leaf Clover by China Glaze. This green is so pretty, it has to be one of my favorites. And just wait until we put a mat on this design. I'm a dying over here to show you. I was given this no-name glitter polish as a gift, and Lance's mom said she got it from Sally's Beauty. I'm going to apply the glitter by simply using a toothpick and placing it straight down in a line shape down the center of my accent nail. And I'm going to probably add a piece to each nail. And here is what the manicure looks like. So which manicure was your favorite? Manicure number one, two, or three? Let me know in the comments section down below. If you guys want to keep seeing nail art, easy nail art for beginners, let me know by leaving this video a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to hit subscribe so that you guys will never miss a video. And don't forget to get your recreations in by using the hashtag LNGLuckyCharms. Alright guys, I'll see you next time. Bye!